all right what's up guys so today is the day that i will be taking the pregnancy test i can't believe <laughs> we are here again 12 days late 12 days late absent of my menzies and um yeah today is tuesday today after veterans day we had off three-day weekend off from work so um i thought it was gonna come it never showed up and uh, so today I, I decided to go ahead and take the test i'm actually at work as you can see i'm wearing my work outfit and um i can't wait anymore i think this is this is just going to continuously bug my mind. I, I, I'm sleeping. I, I can't sleep. I'm thinking about what if, what if it's positive? What if it's positive? What if it's positive? So today I will find out. I am um, going, to, I just went to CVS and bought the test. So I am going to go to the ladies room here at work and take the test. As far as symptoms, the symptoms I've been having is I've been having a bit of back, lower back pain or lower back ache, um, shortness of breath, like almost fatigued. And of course I've been having headaches. Um, I had a really bad headache on, I think it was on Sunday night to a point where I'm like, okay, I ate a big meal. I shouldn't be getting this headache. I checked my blood pressure. My blood pressure was normal. So I'm not really sure. Um, it's just anyways, I, I'm going to take the test and uh, whatever the result is, I know it's uh, part of God's plan. So uh, I just can't believe this. I can't believe I'm about to uh, embark on this route again. Um, but let's see. Let's see if the test is positive. All right. All right. I just took the test. It's about 11 a.m. And um, we've got to wait uh, three minutes for the results. Okay. I can feel my heart beating like crazy right now. Oh my God. My heart is like, I bet it's my heartbeat is like at least 120 beats per minute right now. Okay. All right. Let's take a look. It's been about 10 minutes. <laughs> so let's take a look and see what the result is. Oh my God, I'm shaking. My hands are shaking. I don't know what this means. What does this mean? This is, I don't know what this means. Is this, I don't know what that, what the heck does this mean? Looks like a plus, but it's not a plus. Is that negative? I don't know. I don't know what this means. This is like frustrating. Okay. Uh, I think I think it's it's positive. All right, hold on. All right. So according to this, it says uh, if your results. <sighs> Looks like it's positive. I think it's positive. I'm looking at this right here. This is how it looks. If your result is, oh gosh, I think, I think it's, I think it's positive. I think this is positive. 
future results within 10 minutes disregard any changes after this time. So I think it's positive. Yeah. OMG. Well, it's positive. It's positive. Okay. All right, I'm gonna conclude this test now. Um, I might retake it again when I get home. And um, as it is right now, it's gonna be, it's about, it's, today's the 12th, 12th of November, Tuesday. And uh, 2019, I'm just gonna like basically keep this to myself until I am 100% sure. And um, I'm not letting anybody know until I am ready to let Woozy Bobby know and the family. All right, until next time. All right, guys, I'm in the bathroom. It's Friday. Uh, November 15, 2019. I am whispering because I don't want anybody to hear me. So, it's three days since I last took the pregnancy test. I retook it the next day on Wednesday, the 13th of November. And let me show you guys what the results is. So, looks like it's positive. positive. It looks like it's positive. So, it's for real. I'm going to take the test again with a digital clear blue pregnancy test kit. And I think that one will solidify everything. Uh, will definitely give me the pregnancy or not pregnant on the screen of the result, the result screen. So, yeah. So, and of course the symptoms, the fatigue, tiredness, um, irritability and you know, like a shortness of breath, uh, mood swings, and not so much of the headache, but the morning sickness. You know, I have to eat something in the morning uh, as soon as I get to work, or else I'll just feel very, very like 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 nauseous almost. Anyways, so I just want to give you guys that update. I will take the test tomorrow, early in the morning, and I will hopefully have that also um, recorded live. Um, yeah. Uh, so weird saying doing this again. But yeah, excited. So I gotta go and talk to you guys later. I'm documenting this whole step. When am I gonna do the, the reveal, uh, the pregnancy reveal to my family, to my husband? I think probably I'll see how long I can wait, maybe December. So I'll talk to you. Yes? Hi guys, good morning, good morning, good morning. It's a beautiful sunny uh, Saturday morning uh, of November 16th, 2019. And uh, yeah, I just woke up, kids are awake. Excuse me looking like a grandma. <laughs> but um, so I just wanted to let you guys know that just a few minutes ago, I went to use the bathroom and I did take the pregnancy test for the third time. This third time, they say third time is a charm. Um, this third time I used the same clear blue pregnancy kit, but this is the digital uh, clear blue. So it spells out whether I am pregnant or not pregnant. Mind you, the first two are not digital, but they did, uh, you know, it's a, it's a traditional plus or minus sign. And there was a plus on those two. So, but it was a little bit faded. So, um, I have 
the clear blue digital kit, uh, digital pregnancy kit that I just took. It's been about 10 minutes now. Uh, it's a little bit almost 9 a.m. In, in the morning. So I want to show you guys the results. Show myself the results. Because uh, these pregnancy uh, tests are not uh, cheap. These kits are not cheap. It's like $10. Two in one <laughs> deal. But, anyways, uh, let's see what it says. I have the test here with me. I have, I'm, I'm holding on to the. You know what? Am I excited about whether I'm pregnant or whether I'm not pregnant? To be honest with you, I always say God's time is the best time. But um, I have currently a, a two year old um, and a three year old. The two year old just turned two in July of this year. And the three year old turned uh, three in May of this year. And I'm just like, you know what? The three year old is a boy, and then my uh, little girl and um, is two. So, you know, I said to myself, maybe this is definitely, um, I have a gut feeling that I am. But, uh, and I did take the uh, check to see how far along I am if I were, if I am pregnant. My last. Uh, menstrual cycle uh, date was uh, the, the last day of my last menstrual cycle was on the 6th of October and we are now on um, November 16th so um, that means that I'm six weeks plus a uh, few days of, uh, pregnant if I am indeed pregnant but enough of my chatting let's go ahead and see what the results read and by the way, hubby is downstairs, so nobody knows this but me. Nobody knows I've been having these symptoms. Nobody knows I've been, um, you know, I've been taking this, these tests to see if I'm pregnant, this pregnancy test. But um, I plan to see if I can hold it if I do turn out to... Okay, I'm talking too much. Let's see what this result is, okay? So that's that. I will keep this to myself and I will do periodic um, vlogging as to what my feelings and my symptoms are. But I do plan to definitely let my husband know. Uh, of course, he's the first that will know. I do plan to tell him. Uh, I, I, I really actually want to tell him and the whole family on the same day. But I'll tell him first on that day. And I'm hoping that it will be around Christmas when my sister comes into town uh, to visit. So I just wanted to. I just don't. I don't want. You know, once you tell, once you once you let the news out, or once you let the cat out of the hat, as the saying goes, uh, it's like every minute everybody's looking at you type of funny. And you know, everybody want to know how you're doing. Everybody want to eat your food. Did you, you know? It's like extra extra pampering or extra people are just extra sensitive towards your needs which is a, a good thing too but i think my symptoms will definitely give it away because i've been really craving food and broadcasting it to the whole house oh this this smells good what is that oh i smell nail polish which i did smell nail polish yesterday my mom just did her nails and i'm like oh i smell nail polish and the food is so, food has been quite savory my mom cooked this beautiful oh my god it was just a tasty jollof rice and it was so good it was so delicious and uh, i think she's gonna find out because she's been there she's done it she's experienced it with me you know my first two pregnancies so she knows the cravings and she's gonna be a little side looking at me kind of funny anyways it's about uh five minutes into this vlog i just want to share this with uh, document this uh beautiful news i'm excited i'm happy and um i've always wanted uh we've always wanted a one extra child one additional child in the family so yeah uh, I can't wait to share with Woozy and um, we'll see how these next few months transition so, so it's exciting anyways uh, thank you guys uh, please subscribe to my channel uh, like comment and of course uh, and subscribe um, yeah I'll talk to you guys later. Have a blessed day.
Thank you. Bye. Hi guys. How you guys doing? Like my hat? <laughs> this is really cute. But um I'm all just feeling cozy. Guess what? Today is November 26th. Today is Hubby's birthday. Yes. Today's his birthday. Today's what today's Tuesday. And I have missed two days of work. Monday and Monday yesterday and today I missed work. Because I'm just exhausted. I'm tired. This pregnancy has been so far it's been a blessing yes but it's been tired and i've been fatigued feeling fatigued feeling metallic taste in my mouth feeling exhausted uh very very sleepy oh my god i could sleep back ache chills all over my body so you know what i said you know what i just need another day off from work and uh the kids the good thing is that the kids are in daycare today so I, i've been like free of the kids for the few for the past few hours so today's uh, like i said today's was his birthday my husband's best birthday and um he does not know yet i've managed to keep this secret for a few weeks now and yesterday was the first time i told my mom i basically bright and early in the morning uh, while getting the kids ready for school when she woke up and came down the stairs i basically told her i'm seven weeks she's like seven weeks what do you mean seven weeks and seven weeks pregnant and she was very happy she was so shocked she was so shocked she did not see it coming whatsoever so now the next day is today i am two days ago officially i turned seven weeks so let me catch my breath so today uh, was his birthday so what are we doing today um so far i ordered him a beautiful uh sneakers for work it's like nice nikes he's gonna love it and then i also got him of course guess you guys will not believe this do you remember when i took this test i cannot find the two tests anywhere in the house i thought i put it in a storage but the only thing i found in the storage was the box luckily i have one more test left so i'm gonna take this test and this is gonna be of course positive because this will be the third positive i am gonna put it in a gift bag birthday gift back so this is going to be his second birthday gift so i'm going to make sure i vlog the whole thing so everybody can see it oh my god this is so exciting the kids are in daycare right now so it's just i want to do this before he goes to go pick up the kids for daycare and i also uh, went over to campbell's bakery to buy a small uh slice of birthday cake for him so it's a big celebration and i went to the dollar store i forgot to buy candles so hey what are we gonna do gonna make do with what we got all right, so let me go uh, take the test again, and I'll be right back. Yep. No surprise there. This is number three. 